From time to time I get people asking me about uh, wheelchair users and it's great to think that people are able to actually get out and enjoy the great outdoors despite uh, their um, handicap and I'm going to show you this vehicle here now occasionally get asked about motorhomes motorhomes have been built there was a Heimer group for example when I was at uh, NEC Birmingham in 2016 there was one being shown there and uh, but uh, this company here where I'm at the moment manufactures or converts uh, caravans for use by wheelchair owners and uh, what I'm going to do is to show you this now. First thing here, obviously there's a ramp, special ramp that goes out. It's not here at the moment to allow uh, vehicles to come in and out. Door, as you'd expect, with a uh, mosquito screen. But note, it's an extra wide door. And on the subject of extra wide, notice how much space there is in here. Lots of space for the, uh, the user to actually... Uh, go around quite easily. At the back here we've got this uh, dinette uh, obviously as you expect with any recreational vehicle there's a lot of storage storage all the way around here. Uh, this is a clever bit this toilet is completely different to what you might normally expect in a vehicle. So the door itself is a soft door and uh, a, a curtain and that will go backwards and forwards to allow easy access to the toilet. Now over here we've got the kitchen block. The kitchen block comes with uh, three burners and a uh, sink, as well as having, as you'd expect, storage uh, below. Above we've also got storage there and there's a, there's a fridge also something you'd expect in a recreational vehicle. This is one of these fridges that will open in both directions. So you can open it up from here as well, should you want. At the back, we see that uh, two beds and there is a lot of space uh, between them for the wheelchair. And of course, as one always expects, storage at the back. There's a curtain to close off the sleeping area from the rest of the vehicle. Uh, in here we've got more storage. And in this one here there is a uh, large storage area as well. Quite a lot of light in here. Today's a rather overcast day. So, uh, for those who uh, are interested uh, in something like this, there will be a, a link below. I'm sorry, I'm not a person, I don't know about the needs of wheelchair users, that's the first problem, and I don't uh, know much about caravans uh, so I've never slept a single night in a caravan other than a military trailer that's it so I don't really know much about them my channel is about motorhomes I know a little bit about motorhomes maybe not a huge amount but I do know a little bit nonetheless if you are interested to know more about this uh, uh, hobby vehicle hobby Maxia then there will be a link below and uh, that will give you more information on this subject. But for the moment, thank you very much for watching. I hope you found that interesting. Uh, all the best from me in Germany.